New on GMAT with an idea, a bit of coding, and a 3D printer. One East Texas student has found a way to use some technology to create something helpful for a classmate. GMAT's Andrea Valdez is with us this morning. Now, you sat down with the pair on how coding from the computer became the real thing. How are students using it today? Well, Lane, students at Quitman High School are putting the school's 3D printer technology to good use, and they're creating tools that make activities like marching band a lot more accessible for people. Working alongside each other on the field, these two Quitman High School students began their friendship through an unlikely set of circumstances. Freshman mellophone player Cole Ochoa has a residual limb and uses an instrument that requires the use of both hands to hold up. I just used to hold it up with one hand, and I would put my arm under it. So I figured I was just going to play the mellophone the same way until um, my band director and Nehemiah came up with an idea. An idea that director of bands Michael Barron and other teachers on campus collaborated with to make marching easier for his student. For us to be able to put that that whole system together and being able to have the resources the equipment provides, just the access to everything and just, you know, just knowing that I'm part of a school district, that that helps, it's just wonderful. With the use of the school's 3D printer, junior clarinet player Nehemiah Faulkner originally used the technology in his engineering class to create toys for his teachers in the district. Most of the time when I 3D print stuff, it's kind of just like, just place like things, just put like decorations and stuff, but like I'm using it for like an actual like practical use, I thought that was pretty cool. He was like, I got a kid that's going to help, and he's recommended Nehemiah, who just happens to be my band kid. Using the skills applied in the classroom, he was able to create a 3D printed arm holder to keep Ochoa's arm in place while he moves on the field. Using 3D printing for like a more like helpful purpose, I, I, like, I like that. 15 year old kids over there measuring everything, it was incredible, it was incredible to watch a, a kid that young have that ability. Moving forward, the pair hopes that technology like this can help in other ways. For certain things, um, we should definitely be using technology such as this, especially for people who have like uh, amputees like me. There's so much different like things you can make with a 3D printer. Now throughout the school year, Nehemiah plans to continue doing projects like this to help others who may need them. Lane, back to you. Really, really cool project. Amazing that high schoolers are doing this. Thanks for sharing that with us, Andrea. Six